ability to store a lot of energy in that package, the ability to charge that rather rapidly and still have good durability. With the electric car vehicle industry buzzing with innovation and the race to find the most efficient power source, there's a new contender on the horizon that promises to change the game completely. Toyota, a brand synonymous with reliability and forward thinking, has unveiled its secret weapon, the solid state battery. Stay tuned to find out how this groundbreaking technology might transform the vehicles we drive and the very foundation of the EV industry. A battery-powered automobile will have a similar driving range to a vehicle with an engine and a petrol tank for the first time in the history of EVs, which are produced in large quantities. In the post-engine era, the great family road trip hasn't become tolerable, but it might become a little more budget-friendly. So what is a solid-state battery? Will it provide any more advantages to EVs than other batteries? Well, let's see. Explaining a solid-state battery is rather straightforward. Unlike other battery types, which use a liquid or paste-like electrolyte, it maintains its electrical charge in a solid electrolyte. Solid-state batteries appear to be a perfect fit for electric automobiles since they have a very high energy density compared to other battery types. Hence, they can store more electricity than other batteries of the same size. Most companies have started creating battery-powered and hydrogen-powered vehicles as the public grows more accustomed to EVs. When discussing hydrogen vehicles, almost every car maker mentions that no one fuel will be able to solve the energy dilemma, according to a fast study of the majority of corporate news releases. Additionally, corporate copywriters enjoy using the phrase just one piece of the puzzle when discussing hydrogen fuel cells. Hence, bringing up the figurative puzzle in a hydrogen press release at some time is practically required. The main concern that first-time purchasers have when purchasing an EV is its range. How far can it go on a single liter? The thought is quite logical. While a modern EV's range of about 300 miles isn't bad, it does mean that you have to stop at a charging station more frequently than you would to fill a petrol tank. And charging can take some time. So what is the remedy? We should either have a longer range or quicker charging, and Toyota claims to have the answer. At a technical briefing in early July, Toyota revealed that it had developed battery technology that would eventually allow it to produce an astounding 745 miles of range on a single charge. They also stated that it aimed to develop a battery that would provide an electric car with a range of 900 miles. Don't wait any longer to buy the Prius Prime, though. There are still challenges to overcome and a long way to go, as with all new technology. Since EVs have become more popular, battery research has become significantly better than just 10 years ago, and researchers have been attempting to address the drawbacks of solid-state batteries. According to Toyota, the range and battery weight issues may have been resolved, which was the first business to publicly acknowledge this. Toyota has invested more in hydrogen-powered vehicles than almost any other automaker. Toyota has embraced hydrogen with such zeal that, at times, it has resembled a pet project of outgoing CEO Akio Toyota. The Toyota Mirai has emerged as the standard bearer for hydrogen-powered vehicles. Without creating a crossover instead of a sedan, it is as middle of the road as one can get. Moreover, the Mirai's resemblance to the Camry in design to Toyota cannot be a coincidence. Refueling poses a challenge for sales by incorporating hydrogen fuel cells into a purposefully regular car. JDM fans please note that Toyota revealed a hydrogen-powered version of their crown luxury vehicle that will only be offered in Japan. For a long time, it seemed as though Toyota was one of the few automakers engaged in a gallant fight for fuel, confined to just a few major cities globally. However, now Toyota is a major proponent of using hydrogen in commercial trucks. Despite initially giving the impression that Toyota was betting that batteries would be replaced by hydrogen, it is now clear that the business is approaching the post-ICE future like other manufacturers. Solid-state battery life extension has prevented the technology from becoming commercially viable, but Toyota claims to have solved that problem. The EV landscape may change if the next challenge of achieving mass production capabilities is successfully overcome. Hikori Nakajima, chief technology officer, remarked, We found quality material. He added that, we use it practically and keep up with the rest of the world. Solid-state EV batteries can power a travel range of about 1,200 kilometers with a charge period of 10 minutes or less. 
which is 2.4 times that of traditional lithium-ion batteries. However, solid-state battery electrodes have been shown to regularly expand and contract during charging cycles. As a result, the battery becomes compromised when the electrodes gradually separate from the solid electrolyte material. Moreover, existing solid-state batteries can only be recharged hundreds of times at most, much less than the thousands of recharges needed for a battery ready for the market. The solid-state battery has an anode and a cathode, which still produces electron flow from one side to the other. The electrolyte is the separator between a solid-state battery's anode and cathode. So what was the outcome? A battery with a higher energy density enables producers to pack more energy into smaller containers. Hence, you'll wait less at electric car charging stations since solid-state batteries charge more quickly. The technology has been there for a while, but solid-state batteries have been expensive and challenging to produce, which has kept them from being widely employed. Toyota claims to have streamlined the manufacturing process for solid-state batteries, which might be a game-changer for the vehicles these batteries will power. So can we expect more EVs with solid-state batteries in the future? Or will the price impose a challenge for its expansion? Anyway, we should wait and see. If the technology fully achieves its potential, it will revolutionize the market for electric vehicles. Hence, this means that Toyota might build vehicles up to 900 miles or more. According to the business, we will have to wait until 2028 before we can use this revolutionary battery technology in electric cars. What kind of performance would a car with a solid-state battery have? Toyota claims that its initial model will have a range of approximately 740 miles and be able to charge in about 10 minutes. Since solid-state batteries don't contain the same flammable liquid solution as present batteries, they will also be safer. After years of inaction, the new solid-state battery will enable Toyota to dominate EVs. Even if Toyota is the first to use solid-state battery technology in a car, other firms will undoubtedly follow suit, as we are certain that they have spent considerably in this field. Therefore, even though Toyota has attained attention for its innovations, please don't count on it to be the only manufacturer of long-range, quicker-charging vehicles. Even though it will take some time for these solid-state vehicles to reach the market, the EV experience will most certainly be significantly improved once they do. What does this mean for the automotive market? Will normal vehicles disappear and will EVs replace them? Share your thoughts in the comments. The availability of lithium is one problem that might impact the manufacture of solid-state batteries. Lithium consumption for solid-state batteries may also be far higher than for conventional batteries. According to some studies, solid-state batteries may require 5 to 10 times the lithium of current generation batteries. The element is already in short supply, which is a significant problem. So what is the solution? Currently, it's difficult to say. Recycling EV batteries could be crucial, but even then, it's doubtful that we'll be able to recover enough lithium to supply raw materials for cutting-edge battery technology. We'll have to see how battery makers will respond to this. But since it will take at least five years before we expect to see this technology in production cars, it's feasible that by the time they're ready for the road, the supply situation will have changed significantly. There you have it. Toyota's solid-state battery isn't just another advancement. It has the potential to be the linchpin that truly brings electric vehicles into the mainstream. The possibilities that this technology unlocks, from faster charging times to increased energy density, can change the landscape of automotive history as we know it. And if you found this video informative, don't forget to smash that like button and share your thoughts on Toyota's solid-state battery in the comments below. Do you think it's the revolution we've all been waiting for? And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button to stay updated on the latest in the EV industry and more. We appreciate every single one of you joining us on this electrifying journey.